Hi, I am Frank Semanik, and this is Marie Semanik. We are the facilitators of the St. Thomas Transitional Housing Ministry. We are joined today by Kieran Wells, the new CEO of Bridge, and we will introduce her more formally in a couple of minutes. We want to reintroduce this important ministry with the overall goal of recruiting new mentors to work with families in transition to self-sufficiency. We live in challenging times that are calling out for caring people to get involved and make a difference. Transitional housing is just such an opportunity. It is a service ministry that reflects the heart of the teachings of Jesus to feed the hungry, shelter the homeless, and free the captive. The ministry takes a hands-on approach with persons in poverty and situational homelessness and provides the opportunity for developing self-sufficiency. There are many social issues facing us and transitional housing provides a much needed constructive response. The families we mentor are usually single moms, often from a minority background, experiencing some form of homelessness. We make a real difference with these families, which in turn creates a healthier community. Our mentor team recently graduated a family. A woman and her young children came to us having been in and out of homelessness. She had a number of issues to tackle, and with the help of her mentors, she conquered them. She has a secure job now. She improved her credit score and qualified for a mortgage. She is moving to another state to be closer to family, get more house for the money, with good schools for her kids. She is a great success story. Thanks to the continued generosity of our St. Thomas community, we have the financial ability to bring in one or two new families. What we need now are several mentors to join our team. You've probably heard the saying, give a person a fish, feed them for a day. Teach a person the fish, and you feed them for a lifetime. Well, our mentors provide the social, emotional, and financial coaching and support to help people develop the tools necessary to move toward long-term self-sufficiency. We are aligned with Bridge Communities in Glen Ellen. Bridge provides the multifamily housing units, plus a caseworker and counselors for job search training, child assessment and tutoring, and other important life skills. We are delighted today to be joined by Karen Wells, the new CEO of Bridge. She will give us a brief overview of what Bridge does and how Bridge and St. Thomas partner together. Karen, welcome. Thank you so much, Frank and Marie, and to all of our families and our members at St. Thomas. I'm Karen Wells, and I'm honored to be addressing you today. I just want to share with you how excited we are to continue our partnership with St. Thomas and with the wonderful mentors that have helped and impacted so many lives over the years. And it's true to the mission of Bridge that we depend so heavily on our partners and more importantly, our mentors that spend time, one-on-one -on -one times with our families to help break the cycle of poverty and face the issue of homelessness to self-sufficiency. And with that, I wanna make my own personal plea and request with you to consider being a mentor. It is such an amazing honor. It also will, you will impact lives as well as your lives be impacted. I am a mentor and I will tell you that there is nothing more gratifying and fulfilling than filling the mission that you heard Frank and Marie talk about that God has called us to do on this earth and that is to help others. When we think about our mission at Bridge, our partnerships with local churches like St. Thomas becomes a, a very critical part of what we do. Uh, we are so dependent on the one-on-one -on -one relationship that our mentors have with the families that we serve. I'll leave you with one thing as you think about this. In addition to the mentoring piece, Bridge has wraparound services of children's service, employment services, nutrition to help the families and work in partnership with our mentors. As a first generation college graduate, I know true to form exactly what it means to grow up in poverty and what a child looks at, looks at and faces in poverty. And it's programs like this, my mom, a single parent of 10 children, we would have loved to have had a Bridge Communities. So please, if you have the time, and I know it's hard to see, but I'm sure we can, take the time to consider being a mentor with St. Thomas. It is one of the most rewarding experiences there is. Thank you. 
Thanks, Karen, for joining us and for sharing those important insights. We look forward to continuing our long-term and invaluable partnership with Bridge. Marie? We are asking for your assistance in providing hands-on support of a new family or two. Senior experienced mentors on our team will provide coaching for the new mentors. Bridge has training scheduled, which will be virtual, to cover the basics of mentoring skills. Your meetings with the family will be virtual, at least for the near future, offering safety and flexibility. Since the pandemic hit, Bridge mentors have successfully been providing support through virtual meetings. The interactions with the family usually occur every week or every other week as the situation progresses. Please consider making a commitment to this impactful ministry that is so necessary to support challenged families in our community at this time. We are all called to be the hands and heart of Jesus in our troubled world, and transitional housing is an outstanding way to make a positive difference. For more information, you can contact myself or the St. Thomas Outreach and Social Justice Office. Our contact information appears along with this video. We look forward to gathering new mentors to join our team and to continue to make a difference. Thanks for watching.